What's going on guys? Welcome back to Nolan TCG and we are back here. It's almost the ban list time, so we're kind of figuring that yeah. this won't get hit. We're here with Jasper and his wonderful Shadol deck. Uh, what have you changed, I guess? I've completely like changed the whole deck. I've added Invoked, um, and we just added Invoked and now it's better surprising. So, so. Have you cut the um, the other guys? The Rulones? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I cut all the Magister stuff, yeah. We cut the Magisters and we're focusing on seeing as Alistar is our new normal summon, more consistent as well, and it just adds a little level of like uh, recursion to the deck, which okay. I didn't have before, I guess. Solid, solid, solid. Well, let's take us through your deck profile. Too easy. Alright, we start with three, Ali. Uh, it's pretty standard. I kind of want to play two, but you just need the normal summon. Um, it gets the whole deck rolling, you know. We'll play Triple Wendy, our uh, best Shadol. Um, gets you into everything pretty much. And, it's the, it's the best at all. It's a wind as well, by the way, guys. Uh, two Skamata. Didn't really think about playing three of this, um, just because it really clashes with the rest of the deck, because you're playing like the invoke stuff. So, only two. I only found like you needed two. And you don't play too many Shadol names. You cut down on it a bit. So, it doesn't really come up. Um, for our one-oms, we play one Beast, one Hedgehog, one Dragon. Um, pretty much adds cards. Uh, I like to send this with Foolish if I don't have anything. Uh, just get to what you need, back row removal, and He's, then we play It's a super snail. Yes, dude. Super dragon. Shout out to OTS15. <laughs> yeah, this is like a big blur over here, so yeah. no, you point to this one. This yeah. one's super. <laughs> this one is definitely also super. Um, also, <laughs> shout out to Ben for hooking me up with that. Yeah, I got you that yeah. one. Um, and we play one Ecclesia. We also do play Dogmatic. It's a little Dogmatic package. Um, I find that it's actually really good for the deck, just because Nidia Servant is a free plus. And we only need to play one of the Dogmatic, because Fleur is a brick, so we only play Ecclesia. Because that adds punishment in the best card in the game. Uh, we play Triple Ash for um, one of our hand traps. Ash just hits everything. It hits Red Eyes Fusion. Uh, it hits every deck. That's all you need to say. Um, we play like triple gamma and drive off, mainly because it's a lot. Um, also, like it's such a free um, hand trap. Just because if they like ash uh, shell fusion, you can just like plus off it. Um, and the main reason we play this deck: triple meltdown and a terraforming. Um, meltdown is actually really, really good for this deck. Um, it allows your schism not to be like negated by like a dragoon. It's real um, harsh. It's really, really good. It just like. It's protection for Schism, and it's what the Trap Varian didn't have. It just like, allows you to play through so much more. Um, some opponents will try to negate Schism because they don't think it's a fusion spell. This protects all fusion, I can't, all with fusion summons, so... It's legit the reason we play a stack, and it protects like, all your card effects off like Shell Fusion, so you just go plus 10. Imagine it not being able to be built. <laughs> legit, legit, it's like the fucking best thing. Um, oh, sorry. Ah, uh, uh, it doesn't matter. Uh, we play two Invo, um, two Invo, all you need. You don't want to play one because um, if it gets like DD Crowed, and you don't play three because you'll brick on it. Uh, three uh, Shell Fusion, just, it's like the best um, fusion spell. You go, on, you go second, you resolve this card, you win the game. Uh, we play 2L. It's really versatile and I really like this card, but it bricks out. It doesn't brick like Shell Fusion, because Shell Fusion, um, you can use it with like, you know, so many benefits. Um, we play one Foolish Burial, any Shell. Uh, we play Triple Super Poly. Um, don't look at this one. This one is non-existent. Um, you got ulti. 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 Not, Not ulti. ulti. Soon to be ulti. Um, pretty much this card, Stops Dragoon. Uh, it adds like really like a lot of stuff just because all the invokes are like different attributes, I guess. So. And you're playing the cute extra card. We'll yeah. see later. We'll, we'll see, see later. later. Uh, we play triple Meteor 7. Um, quite a great of the deck. Consistency? Consistency. Just legit consistency guard. Um, gets you Schism. For our traps, we play one Rush, two Schism. Um, the reason for two Schism is because of cards like Cosmic Cyclone and Aquero. Yeah. Um, it'll get banished, so we play two and one Incarnation. Um, we don't really play the combo for this deck. We'd rather use Incarnation just to keep on bringing back some resources. Yeah. Um, and our last trap is Punishment. You add it off Ecclesia. Um, shout out to the Super. They're like fucking 20 bucks. It's ridiculous. But, um, I was trying to be all suspenseful and I was going to be like, is, is the last card a Shadow game? And then you flip Punishment, I was like, obviously it's Punishment. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> yeah. the reason why we don't play Sinister Shadow games is because um, we don't play that many shells, so it doesn't plus too much, and the flip effect of it doesn't come up that much in this variant. Yeah. Um, so moving on to the extra deck. We play one Gravity Controller, gets, um, put it here, it gets um, Construct your Grave, it adds Avermax, pretty much all you need in there. Um, we play one Relona, 
Wait, um, that's Evermax. Uh, that's it. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't I was like, that's Evermax. <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah, that card will be broken now. This out to Evermax, and like the deck has big issues with like cards like that, I guess. Um, and one Artemis. We play for our last link. We play Lambda. I don't play that many links, and that's mainly because um, you are able to OTK with like all your fusion stuff. Um, Lambda's really good because you play Gamma. It's actually really easy to make. And currently, it's like the best link two that I think this deck can, can um, play. Okay. Um, if you have space, I'd obviously say play like um, Celine and Axis Code Talker, but Lambda, Lambda's great. I guess if you're not playing the super, you're playing like super poly targets. Yeah, like, so, uh, not really actually, but okay. we do play like a heavy fusion Come on, I got the So we play so double window, um, just because if they can out one, they can't out two. Um, you don't need the third. The reason why there was no locals final card. <laughs> yeah, this Salamane Great can't play through this card. Yeah, sorry for the no um, yeah, I can't. finals so, this tomorrow week. Tomorrow is definitely going to be actual locals and not just <laughs> us messing around. But yeah, this card, most decks can't out, out yeah, no, no. this. Oh, I can't play through one, especially two. That's why I only play two. Um, two Apclone, just because the third actually doesn't really come up. Um, it's a negate, and you send it with Nadia, and like you can send it, you can summon it in extra months zone and send it with gravity control, it like goes plus, I guess. Pretty much add anything. Yeah. Uh, we play triple constructs. I have three ultis now. Oh, we have Look three at that. ultis now. Three ultis. I was going to point out that the first one was an ulti, but instead we've got three ultis. Three ultis. Three ulti constructs. Yes, max rarity. You got to do it for the dolls. First end. Um, it's the best card in the deck. It's construct it out to everything. Um, gets you schism. Don't need to say anymore. Um, so for the invokes, we play two Nekoba. Um, I was playing one for a bit, but like if they out the first one, you want to go into something which like does something. Um, so you just, two's nice. It's also good to make another one on the board. Um, funnily enough, you can put two of these together and make BFD. Wow. But oh, VFD's banned, yeah. hopefully. Uh, we also play this. This is really good as a super poly target, just because you can like normal summon um, Alistar and then just go super poly and get rid of a Dragoon or something. That's hot. Um, I never actually thought of that. Before. Yeah, <laughs> it's um, it's actually really good. This card's really good. Um, with Meltdown on field, if you summon this and you go target like let's say a Herald um, of Ultimate in this, they can't chain it because Meltdown protects it. So it's like legit a pop with um, not being able to respond to, which is like insane. Okay. Um, and for our last invoked, we play Ragin. Okay. Um, mainly because we do play three Wendy. And this card's like, um, kind of like, you can make it to protect window, like if like your opponent's deck can only special summon once, they summon beaters, you just summon this and keep flipping it face down. Um, and it's just like, in worst case scenarios, you, you, you can have to make this and it's good. Flip a Salamane great monster. Yeah, <laughs> legit. Um, we do I'll play Droll in the side. Do you want to see your side deck? Might as well. Oh uh, yeah, we'll go yeah. through the side. So, and um, also against Bird Up, um, this is like the only out, um, if you have Super Poly and like Alistar, um, you just so super poly the like win barrier statue and like you win. Okay. Um, and our last card enters. It's not really a fusion monster. It's, you never summon it, but um, <laughs> what you, it's a pop one. It's purple. You can super poly into this against something. Dude, surely. you can't. It, it says a synchro. It says must be special summon. Oh, Do no. not use. Yeah. No. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah. So I was thinking about summoning this against like we have a few Infernoble players here, and then I'm like, oh wait, doesn't do anything. Can't. Can't. <laughs> Card's bad. Um, you only play one because you only play one punishment and you'd rather send like other cards with your deal. Yeah. Um, for our side deck, right, we got triple Cosmic Cyclone. Um, this is the best uh, spell and trap card removal. It's good against Eldritch, it's good against Shadows. Um, just being able to quick play banish something is ridiculous. Um, and then I guess like the other best um, spell and trap removal, Harpy's Feather Duster. It's unbanned, so we play it, you know. Uh, we play one Pankratops, best going second card, it's at one. Uh, triple Joel and Lockbird. Um, Drytron's like such a crazy match that we need this against it. Um, also hits like the invoked um, Dogmaticas. It hits a lot of things and you play it because it hits a lot of things. And that's the same for your boy Lancia. This card's legit ridiculous. Like you can, um, most decks which um, lose to this, lose to it hard. So if you can Lancia it, you pretty much win the game. And the only, the problem was with this card was that I was actually not going to play it because Mecha banishes and Schism banishes. Yeah. So it clashes like crazy with this deck. But going second against um, something like Virtual World, you need to, you need to do this because Nibiru doesn't really do much. Yeah. So that's my thoughts. Cause, like, it's also a light. Yeah, exactly. It is a light. Yeah. I and mean, it did come up quite a bit today. Uh, triple Nib. Um, combo, uh, combo deck, um, this card's insane, it's Nibiru, best card, um, it's also a lot, um, I'm not playing this 
um, in main deck just because there's a lot of decks that our locals which doesn't lose to it. That's why we play Gamma. And our last card is Ariel. Uh, Ariel just banishes three. It's yeah, really side, good. Side this really in against good. Dragon Maid. He side, yeah, I side this in against um, Ben's Dragon Maid. It's like the one deck I worry about at locals. Um, Loki, uh, not. But um, you use, use this against Drytron, use it against Salad, use it against um, Elder. She uses this against like every single deck which uses the graveyard. There's a few decks here which don't use the graveyard, so the second one actually breaks the new lander. But um, you, that's why you side it. Awesome. But thank you very much for the deck profile. No worries. Um, I think everyone at Locals is waiting for us so that we can go home. <laughs> yeah, to get our packs. As always, have a good afternoon, everybody.